Welcome guys to TechPress. In this tutorial, let's focus into how to use linked popped application. Ever wondered how your website should look with an actual landing page uh, linked in bio website? Well, today is the day because I'm going to be showing you how to use linked in bio. Now, what I wanted to do is to use this website to only add featured products and add this directly into our socials with an actual LinkedIn bio website. So uh, what I wanted to do here is to go into my Shopify, go into apps and directly into apps, you wanted to go and look out for LinkPub. LinkPub is an actual website application that was created with uh, Shopify to just generate an actual website uh, really, really easy and fast. So you can be focusing into the marketing and not a lot into the design and all of that. So what I wanted to do here is to go into create a page. Of course, just in case you haven't had the link pop or a Shopify website, I'm going to leave you a link down below in the description so we can all get started totally for free and then later on having a huge deal here into this uh, here into our website. So what I wanted to do here is to go into create my first of all, my, my profile. So here's going to be asking what's the name of your linked pub. Let's say for example, it's going to be by Nerdst store. Now it's going to be asking you to upload a profile. So I'm going to hit into upload image. And here what you want to do is to just add a image that resonates with your store. Now later on, here's the profile name. In our case, let's go for it by Nerdst. And now the profile description, let's say everything for your gaming experience. This is our slogan, something like that. So hit now to create my profile. And just like that, my bonus section has now been created right away. So first of all, what I wanted to do is to focus into adding everything, all the media, all the products, all the links, all the uh, Amazon, whatever. And then later on, I can move on into the style. So let's move on really easy into adding the elements. So first of all, what I wanted to do is to share products that were directly from my Shopify store. So here I go for browse products. And I was going to add five of them. Let's say for example, one, two, select it. And here's the product name. So let's say for example, the head count on T and I can add more if I want to, for example, add product, add product and add product. So browser product, I select the second one. I do exactly the same thing with the third one and the fourth one. So as you see, actually, it looks really great. So there we go. It actually looks uh, great so far. Now, if you are an affiliate into Amazon, what you can do is to uh, copy and paste the products you wanted to, let's say, uh, add it for people who wanted to buy a specific product. For example, this one. So the product name, let's say for example here, I just leave this like that. Try to make this a little bit much more shorter and easy. Now that I have all the elements added into my website, now let's move on into the customization. So here I'm gonna hit now into style. Now the background color, here into the background color, what you can do is to delete all of these elements and try to add your own. In this case, I'm going to focus into something more, much more bluer. So uh, such as the profile name, the profile description, the social media handles now appears in here. So just for the purpose of this tutorial, I'm going to try to add my Shopify, my email and here into the Facebook, what I want to do is to only type Shopify just to make sure that it has just the handle of all of these products. So I scroll a little bit down, scrolling down, down, down and hit now and to save. Now let's get into published. My website should be created right away. And open this into a new tab to make sure it actually looks great. As you should see here, I now have my linked pub created right away. And you see that we have all of my elements created. So I'm gonna just click into one product to make sure this actually sent me directly into my website store. So I click on it and there we go. As you see, I have all the elements about my product. For example, the color, the size, the at the back to buy it now, the specifications and so much more. So this is how we actually use the linked pub. And the last thing here to you is that as you go back here into the link pub section, you have the analytics. And here into the analytics, you can see how many people clicked into your product, how many people uh, check out the visit, how many people visit your profile, and so much more. But only specifically speaking about this link that we created right away. And there you have it, guys. A really easy way to get started with a linked pop. 
Really, really amazing application. Mastering the link power by Shopify, your ultimate LinkedIn bio tool. So if you find this card helpful, please give us a thumbs up, subscribe for more Shopify insights. Thank you so much for watching the video, guys. Hopefully, uh, we actually helped you to find out how to use this great, great application inside Shopify. And well, guys, remember you have the link down below in the description to get started here with the Shopify for free and then later on having a huge deal discount. Thank you once again for watching the video, guys. See you next time.